we're going to tie another pike tinsel tube fly. This time, pretty big one, uh, and with a silver core, and then red outer to it. So I have a six millimeter tube here. Gel spun and then a run of super glue just to hold that in place. Wrap into it a little bit. So I'm going to put on a, a bit of pearl crystal hair here as a core to the tail. Back of the base is about 10 inches. I'm going to make this fly. So, next, I'm going to take a bunch of lametta. on itself. And we'll just cut that off. So there's no point in wasting the bits you cut off, you might as well put it in there to bulk that up a bit more. Forced silver tinsel, pull out a bunch, double it over and cut it in two, double it over again and cut it in two, and then misalign the two bunches to give us that little bit of taper. And we wrap that around the shank, get on a couple of wraps, and then fold it back on itself again. Core. So it depends on how bulky you want this fly. But I said I have to tie a couple of smaller versions of it as well. I'll not just put as much material into it, but on this one, as it's a big one, I'm going to double over another bunch, but not as long. Tie it across and fold it back. So basically we're just progressing up the, the tube. off my hand end up like a circle. Cut it in two. Wrap that around. And 
handle it back on itself. It all just layers up. stuff. Now we're trying to make a head, so I'm going to use another bunch of that uh, smaller rib. So you could also put on a fur or something at this stage and fold it back to make a head. Or a fibre, if we're going to stick with the old tinsel theme here. head. You can leave white if you want, you can colour it in whatever. I'm using a, a sort of a Pantone marker here. I'm going to colour the lay in, or the head in, sorry, red. take up the uh, the red ink or whatever color you'd chosen to put into it. And that is our big red and silver tinsel tube done. We just need eyes on that. I think I'm going to go for a big silver. So 
So we take our Evo Stick Serious Glue. And here I've got a, I think this is a 12 millimeter silver eye. I'm just applying a good blob of glue onto the back of that. back of the head that we made a little bit and then we'll repeat the same to the other side just flip her over to just take a little bit of my glue back onto the eye uh, just fold it over into it and see it's not as neat as just putting a straight small blob on the back but I think that it's more secure in the long run Silver tinsel tube. That one's ten inches long.